Oh, is this thing on? It is on. Is this thing on? Yep. Yep, it's on. All right. This is your obligatory 30-second intro. This is just kind of like random clips uh, for me skating at the parks and things I throw around because I'm trying to get better and more consistent at everything from the basics still, uh, whether it's ollies or, or grinds or whatever, because I got a 2020 trick list. You know, we'll, we'll talk about that, I guess. So always start off with some ollies. These ollies probably don't look terrible, but this is not my normal ollie. Like, I really have to think about still ollieing well or doing a clean shove it uh, every time I go out because uh, I don't skate enough. And 50-50s are trouble uh, locking in, which is crazy because my first year of skating, oh, fell. Fell. My first year of skating, all I could do was 50 50s, and now I'm having a lot of trouble locking in. It's my boy Pablo getting after it. He ain't been on a board in a while. Came out to skate with me. Some of these clips are from December and January. That was the Battle of the Bench. I'll link that video up top. That was pretty cool. That was fun. Probably the closest thing I've ever done to it, like street skating. And then I was trying to learn how to ollie up a bank uh, into a 50 50. And like I had never ollied up a bank onto anything. So like this is a challenge. I'm still working on it. These are the backside grinds, slappy grinds, because I don't have any backside grinds at all. So I figured I'd learn it on slappy. Oh, don't try slappy 5-0, because then you do backslide 5-0. Uh, so I thought I'd work on it. And I still don't look at it. This is a trip from Kansas City. And this is just a cool obstacle, so I wanted to skate it and do a little drop off. I thought I was going to try manual and then drop off, but I, I couldn't get the manual. So then I thought I'd 50-50 it, and it was dark and it was late and it wasn't skating very well. It did not happen. There's a rail that's way outside of my comfort zone. And then back to this another day, you know. I don't know why I see guys doing the bumps to rails and bumps to box and they go flying. And uh, I just don't have the timing down yet. This was right after I learned the big spins, fakie big spins. So I wanted to keep working on them every time I go out so I can improve them. A little shove it, a little shovey shove. Hey, that's not bad. A little tic tac at the end. Oh, I tried to 50 this. I couldn't lock into it, and then I got rolling so fast off the drop off, like I didn't know what to do at the end. So I just jumped off. I should, I should probably go retry that. These little Wally deals. So I'd never tried these, so there I ate it, and then that one I put my foot down, and then boom! I was like, oh, that's cool. This is pretty fun. Keep doing those. It's a little bigger box. A 50. Rode on it a little bit. Popped it in. I just left this shot in here because it was a cool shot. That's all. I like the sun. But yeah, so I do a lot of 50 practice because it's inconsistent. And because it's inconsistent and the way I land, I don't lock in solid. I haven't learned how to get tricks out of it two years into this journey. So I'm going to keep working that. And for rails, I just bought myself a flat bar. So I'm going to start working that as well. Oh, I tried a front side little Wally thing. That didn't work. So I went back to the back side. These are fun. Like, I know that doesn't look like much, but that is scary and hard. And then this this wall, it's pretty steep. So I was trying to get to the very top and grind it. There's my boy Alfonso, always providing good encouragement. So I thought, I'd, you know, I was trying to get up top of this thing. I haven't made it up to the top yet. It's a slow roll up and then uh, do something up there and come down. I don't know. I'm going to keep trying it unless this happens. Yeah. Here's Gen. He's getting tricks. Always good skate motivation uh, when you got good people to skate with. He's crushing it. So that fakie big spin I learned, I want to see if I can learn it on a hip. It started raining that day, so we had to leave. But that was a little low on the hip. But I went back. Boom! Look at that. It's not still, it's not super cool, but for me, this is really good. It's kind of like, you know, it's low, but it's uh, more than just flat ground. So it's a step in the right direction. Another day I go back. So again, heel flips. I think I'm going to learn heel flips on a bank first but i was just session in this little pyramid with this dude craig craig was cool man craig was killing it he's motivating me to get after it better shove fakey shove toe drag fakey shove no pop yeah crazy oh watch this so craig was like throwing this around and then uh and then he crushed it and he got he got pumped he got pumped yeah play that again here it comes boom made it it's going up a little transition on the other side coming back at you boom getting tricks 
it was motivating me, man. And then started going back at those heel flips. Oh, you got a little, little boneless there. And boom, ah, watch this. Watch my front foot. I almost got it on the board. I never, never get both feet on the board. Watch my toes. Ah, slip past it. it. Hurt. It hurt so bad. It hurt my heart. All right, and then next one. Both toes. Both toes. Like heel flips are coming soon. 2020. Watch out. Watch out for heel flips. I promise they're coming. All right. So here's what happens when I try heel flips on flat ground. Go up and my foot, you know, goes straight to the ground. When I do that on the bank, I don't have that problem. Um, I get my keep my front foot up more. And then I left this in here for the, you know, the the, the good of the order. Yeah, yeah, that sucked. But it is what it is. And then I try to random uh, fakey heel right after I walk away and recover from this. That didn't go well either. But either way. I try these tricks. There's a fakey heel. Yep. First one tried. I'll probably get back after it. Anyway, I make these videos just to you know show the progress. So yep, 43 years old. Not very good, but I'm out there and I'm gonna get, just keep skating and try and build that consistency and and uh, I think it's gonna go better. Like I'm, I'm getting out there a little more each time, and each time it's a little better. So we will continue to fight. We will not be defeated. We will win. I don't even know what that means. I don't even know what that means. This is what I know. I'm going to keep skating and I'm going to keep having fun and it's going to continue to be rad. So you stay rad. Have a good one. Turn that, turn that on, turn this off.